Whoa, 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 welcome to another video of Hardabash playing Minecraft. And uh, yeah, today I don't know if it will be play chill, telling a story, or um, uh, significant events happen. After all, we are waiting for to be able to do more stuff than what we had already. So. Um, ah, yes, uh, there is some cleaning happening here. Who, who did it? I wonder who did it. Actually, I did it in, uh, off the camera. I was like feeling bad about that just doing all the stuff on the camera, though I shall not because that's how the let's play go. I mean, it's an all niche thing. Look to this guy. I didn't hit him. So basically, yeah, I was saying I I made a, a renovation here. Um, no need for that wall, I believe. So I, I need to take it out later. I don't know where is Frederick, and I don't think that I have enough emerald now to buy my stuff. You you know you are not my Frederick. I don't know why. Because you are beside the smithing table, like your feather, it's not a clear indication that you are not Frederick, but anyway, what, what I'm talking about. David, where is Frederick? Do, do you have any idea where is Frederick? Uh, my diamond Frederick, where, where are you? Here is Frederick. So basically, uh, I need to buy a shovel from you. Yeah, a shovel. I need to buy a shovel from you. Thank you very much, Frederick. You are one of my best villagers, actually. You are better than Lion these days. I don't know why. Actually, there is a story in my mind. Last video made me remember another story related to LA, which is basically uh, a story where I stuck at the Union Station, so at that night I was basically going to San Diego from the Bay Area, the, the San Francisco Bay Area, and I had to basically take the express bus and then the plan is to take the train and uh, basically there was a lot of bad things happen. I will not mention the the company for that I used for the bus service, but their bus doesn't has an electrocuted outlet. Like there is no outlet to get uh, to charge your phone from it. It's there, but it's not on, and uh, that gave obvious troubles basically because. Uh, my phone was a little bit old, I believe it was Pixel 3, and um, I needed my phone to pay for everything. Uh, so basically, I had, I ended up in the train station late, and um, what happened is I couldn't get the ticket in the time. I, I ran um, looking for uh, Wells Fargo nearby that's so I can withdraw some money because um, the ATM machine that was in the, in the train station that can read the phone can't recognize uh, other than their uh, card. They don't recognize uh, the others from um, so basically I had to run to some Wells Fargo bank because the ATM for Wells Fargo was um, not with a phone reader thing um, I'm talking about in the train station which is that's super bad that's not just bad that's a, a trouble bad let me start the story from the beginning, okay? So, I was going to San Diego and I didn't have a car. I was hoping that I will get 
a car from San Diego, to be honest. Um, unfortunately, I was uh, not at the right place to to expect that. And um, because of the the bus that has a no a charging outlet, and that's bad. Uh, so basically, I um, I had to run. Yeah, I remember now where I stopped. I had to run very fast to get a someone's Fargo guy, a bank, and I barely opened my phone just to withdraw amount of money so I can get the, the ticket, buy the ticket and do these things. Like I said before, I'm a fatty boy. My calf uh, suffered hardly for that and uh, I had to to run very fast uh, to my way um, but unfortunately uh, because of few misguidance here and there a lot of things that if one of them didn't happen I would have enough time but somehow I missed 10 minutes uh, from the train so yeah I hear the phantom and here he is uh, since long time no see man so like I said I was I was stucking around the the, the Union Station here it is I was worried that I will hit the iron golem. So like I said, I, wa I stuck around the Union Station. I never saw this amount of Class A drugs consumed in the street in my life, to be honest. I mean, at that night, had uh, I, I saw people smoking meth more than all the 10 years I spent before in, uh, in California. So I was like new in the matrix, uh, avoiding crack clouds. Do you want to go to me? Are you sure? Here we go. Lady sit beside me in the pension. She was a super skinny lady. And with all the flattery could be in her sound, she asked me, Do you have by any chance a small piece of man? And so I got shocked, to be honest. And she, she caught me off guard. I mean, I, I never thought that it could be possibly in one day in my life that a lady will ask me about the drugs this casually. One of the things I saw, as soon as I got, let's say, as soon as I got out of the train station, before all these things that I said happened to my life, as soon as I got from the train station, while I was uh, looking for, um, what do they call it? some uh, gas station to to get some stuff i had I, I saw like a shadowing thing and i i just give it it a more serious look and that shadowy thing was uh a huge man but a huge buffy not a huge fat a huge buffy man was he sleeping in his back um, closing his eyes, leaving his moment, and he was, uh, I don't know how to say this, he was kind of dating himself, let's say, he was living in his fantasy, and, uh, yeah, since then I knew that it will be a weird night, and, uh, um, I wasn't mistaken by anyhow, uh, after all, I... I had to deal with all the things that I said that I had to deal with. I felt the situation 
in, in, in the LA homeless crisis, it's uh, orchestrated. Okay, what we have here? Well, this one has a good. It has a kid as well. I need to have a sandal for this uh, baldy guy. So basically, we decided to clean this area as well. Lately. Okay. Actually, I can use these for emerald. Now I think about it. That will cook, I believe, 60. I think I make a sum overkill here. I made a sum overkill here because we need this one to this level. So basically, these will be. Someone bought it for this thing. Man, that's a, that's a rare hit. That's a rare hit. They they want to go down, but. You worry. Not like this guy. I'll give them encourage to move to toward me. Like this guy. Yeah, like this guy. They remind me to go to the bed, I think. They are not trying to be that hostile. It's their way to say go to the bed. I appreciate this with the, the membering that they give as a gift for me to remind them that it's not their business. Oh my goodness, one, two, three, four, five, six, I think five. Anyway, that's it for now. I hope you enjoyed this video and if so, please leave a like and write a comment about stuff that you want me to hear the best in Minecraft. As also, hit hard on the subscribe button and jiggle the bells for more notification. Until then, I will camp here and let my sheep rest for another video and then see you all. Mm.